Toronto Rock assistant coach Dan Lattisir, what do you take away from Friday's win against Calgary? Uh, defensively, I thought we had a, a solid start. Um, we implemented some of the some of the principles that we're trying to instill in the in the guys in the back door. Uh, obviously, room for improvement. Um, gave up some shots that aren't in necessarily in our shot selection, and need to do some work on our special teams. But uh, overall, I I liked our compete level, and uh, I liked what we provided offensively out the back door. Few key losses defensively early on, uh, with uh, Patrick Merrill and Bill Greer being added to the IR. What kind of adjustments do you have to make uh, moving forward? Big losses for sure. Um, basically, we were asking guys to, to step up. There's some guys that are second year players that we said you're going to have a pivotal role this year, um, whether those guys are healthy or not. So they're just uh, more opportunity as opposed to, to pressure for these guys to step up and play a bigger role. And, and our young guys are going to have to come in and, and get up to speed very quickly, which, you know, th all through camp they've been doing that. So. Speaking of younger players, uh, Ethan O'Connor played his first uh, regular season game with the Rock, uh, picked up a couple of assists and a goal. Your thoughts on his play uh, defensively? Good. Uh, after the first shift, he gets knocked down a couple of times. He found his feet, and uh, he's got great athleticism, uh, real nose for loose balls. Um, we're going to work on some more of his, you know, sort of stay-at-home D stuff and, and really, you know, lean on him for the transition game. And, again, he's, he's a real hound on the loose balls. And uh, as he gets stronger and more experienced, I think he's going to become a key part of our system. The Buffalo Bandits uh, up next, your first road test of the season. How do you prepare for uh, the Bandits, and what will be the key defensively for you? I think it's going to be a lot of the same. We're not going to make a whole lot of changes as far as our defensive uh, principles. Um, we're going to look at some game film, look at uh, some of their habits and um, how, where they would like to get their shots from and see what we can do as far as putting the, those shots to, to where we want on the floor, um, give the shots that Nikki wants to see, uh, and again, try to exploit a little bit in transition because we have the athletes in the back end to do it. All right, thanks, Laddie. Yeah, you bet.